Tim's work advice, many of you may have watched it personally, but I'm sure that a greater majority of you heard the backlash that she got for it. And you're probably all thinking, Lisa, what does this have to do with the Federal Jobs Channel? Well, I'm Lisa, and I'm going to tell you what Kim just might have gotten right. I like to throw in quotes and academic insights every now and then because I'm in school. I hope you don't mind. So here's one from not Kimmy just yet, but from MD Babcock. The tests of life are to make, not break us. Trouble may demolish a man's business, but build up his character. The blow on the outward may be the greatest blessing to the inner man. I've never seen a person who's strong and has had an easy path because it's because of your difficulties in your journey that gets you to it. The mountains that you have to climb or the treacherous roads you had to cross, be it in combat as a veteran, stereotypes and prejudices that discriminated against you, barriers due to your disabilities, biased against your gender or religious views. The reality, the reality is that the federal government is neither concerned about your individual comfort or your convenience. It is all about our comfort and our convenience, no matter which side of the political or reality television you stand on. Get your effing A up and work. It seems like nobody wants to work these days. Yeah, that's what Kim said in her video with Variety. But she also used it in combination with her personal reference to creating content and social media development. We all have a strength on the inside. A bad attitude is like a flat tire. You're not going anywhere until you change it. Now maybe that's what Kim was trying to say. Smart people, we are all attracted to what we see on the outside of others. No doubt, Kim is a beautiful woman. However, when we get a glimpse of what a person is like on the inside, it may turn us off completely. Did we see that then? Well, it depends on what you're looking for. Looking good is never enough, but progressing in knowledge, skills, and abilities is critical to remaining relevant as a job seeker. Our national infrastructure and our global market participation is changing. And as the job market increases its demand for skilled labor, there are so many people who are competing to acquire various skills to secure opportunities, both in the private and in the public sectors. I need you to make sure you're one of those people. If you're not working, enroll in a class, volunteer your services, support or create a business, even if it means that you're volunteering your services. Keep your skills and yourself relevant, which is work all by itself. What I know is that Kim is not going to work in a federal government office in that dress, but the work that she does requires that she leave her home and her children, maintain a fitness regimen that can get into that dress, and have the confidence to speak her mind to millions. Now that I gotta give her is a struggle and is work. If we believe that struggles are built into our journey, then it, of course, it's gonna be hard to take advice from a woman who didn't have struggles to arrive where she is. Or did she? The truth is we don't know. I didn't walk a mile in those stilettos and I likely can't. Maybe if I knew her struggles to get into them, I wouldn't even want to, would you? But I do know she has done a phenomenal job in keeping herself relevant. Your development as a professional is of great concern when you work for the federal government. And I know there are people who watch my channel who already work for the federal government and are looking for advancements. There, many of you, many of us, in order to maintain that position for the federal government, had to push through, overcome, stick out months 
even years of disappointment. The scrutiny is not easy and it is very real. I absolutely did not get referred to every job that I applied to and I definitely didn't get every job I interviewed for, but I did get one. That's my big break and that is the one that matters because now I don't even remember how many I applied for or how many interviews that I went on. And neither will you. When you're looking back on it, it'll seem easy. When others look at you, it'll look like a privilege. So what are we looking for in Kim? Are we looking at the outcome or are we looking at the journey? Remember, the tests of life are to make, not to break us. Now, she doesn't look appear broken at all. So it must be working. Persevere, my friends. It's hard. Keep working the tutorial and the videos because they work. I just make it look easy without stilettos. Bye for now.